we should call him. Oh, oh we should call him. We should call him. Okay, I'm gonna call him right now. For what? Pick up, pick up, uh, my Jeep. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Antonio. <laughs> so are you gonna come see me? Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today's video is about Chris cheating on Quinn with the mistress that has all the receipts. So if you guys don't know, Chris and Quinn are a couple here on YouTube and they actually have almost 2 million subscribers and they basically have a little family with the son called Baby Chris or CJ. Um, so a couple hours ago actually, a video came up on YouTube of like a couple of girls talking about how literally a few days ago Chris was cheating on Quinn. Um, basically, I you guys know this channel, I never pick any side. I'll just tell you guys what I think about the situation. So we are about to watch the video and react to it. And at the same time, I will say what I would do if I was in this situation. And yes, guys, but first, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. Comment, like, and subscribe, like I said, for more videos of me. And comment down below, like, what you think about this situation, like, and share this around, because this needs to get to the people that are involved, which are Chris and Quinn and these girls. They have to hear what, you know, I have to say, basically, because I think what I have to say is pretty important, because cheating is never okay for me on my end. And plus, it's one thing to cheat on your girlfriend, and it's a whole other thing to cheat on your wife. Like, they are married, if I didn't mention that earlier. They are married. So, yes, guys, we're going to be watching it and reacting to it, okay? All right. That's him for sure, like, he cannot say it's not him. You guys may or may not know of Chris. Um, Chris and Queen are, is a YouTube couple. Uh, they're pretty much famous, almost uh, 2 million subscribers for their relationship. They have been together. Basically, some stuff happened. Uh, how many days ago? Two days ago. Two days ago. Personally, Queen... No matter how much you're getting out of this relationship that you have with Chris, like you honestly deserve so much more than that. So I agree. The story starts with the two of us. Um, basically, we got invited to the club. This club in downtown LA. No, was it in Hollywood? Yeah. It was in Hollywood. It was Friday night. And so we were sitting down at a booth. And he whispers in my ear and says, I'm going home with the both of you guys. And I just started laughing like, 
does this and he starts touching on me and he's like grabbing my butt and I was really tipsy and kind of just delusional at that point and I look over and he has his hand on Lena's butt and he's just he's like this. holding the bulk of us. Okay, so fast forwarding, we were talking on Saturday, we were just texting and FaceTiming and then he really wanted to see, uh, he said he really wanted to see me. So on Sunday, um, texting me that he wanted to come over, I was like, yeah, sure, and like, why not? Like, we can hang out and stuff with the girls. So he comes in and he's just like, giving me a hug and he's flirting with me and grabbing all of me and they're just like, which one of you is a freak? And I was like, what? And then he's like, which one of you is a freak? And I was like, what the hell? Like, what the hell is wrong with you? Like, how are you going to flirt with the both of us? He started talking to us about his YouTube channel. We had a really good conversation. Mind you, we have no idea who he is. Yeah. He, he never say, watched his YouTube. He's just basically talking about how he has a baby mama and they're like good friends and they started YouTube together. So baby mama. He for like the money, talked to us about how they fake their pranks. And I mean, she is, but that together, so. And, and they're married. Yeah, she's just like whatever, but like they kind of just are on the same page that they do all this for money. And now that he is not here, we have got the perception that he lied, and she seems to think that they are happily married. Yeah. We were never told he was married. He was single. He doesn't have a ring on his finger. No ring. He just made us think he did some YouTube with his baby mama, but they only did it for money. And Looking at Quinn and this girl, there's no competition. Like, Quinn is way better than her. So, what was he doing? Guys, and. for him. Bye. Really, really Thank you for watching this YouTube video. Oh, we should call him. Oh, this is sad. We should call him. I'm going to call him right now. And this is where, like, I didn't have to believe everything that happened before, but this is when I believed everything they were saying. Just watch. Queen, whoever is that friend he's with, I'll cut him off too because I'm sure he knew he knows about this. So are you gonna come see me? So yeah guys so that that was the video basically the girl he cheated on Quinn with has all the receipts so I really wonder why he can really say that would make Quinn believe that he didn't cheat on her and if you guys don't know they actually had like a misunderstanding that like an argument like every couple does and um, they decided to be away from each other for a couple of days and it's during that period of time that he went ahead and cheated on her which is actually really messed up because normally when you argue with your partner you want to be away so you can really sit and think not so you can really go out there and mess around you know i really love chris and queen i love watching chris and queen but i feel like 
every time I used to hear about him cheating on Queen, I was really never believing it until like what I just saw. I was like, this is crazy. And like I watched other couple YouTubers like D uh, DMB Nation. And my favorite YouTube couple is actually DK4L, which I know most of you guys know them. And you, like, I have never heard of anything that Ken did or Diera did. That's because of the way they carry themselves and what they do. Um, even if, even if you are to cheat on your girlfriend, like, after you have been caught once or twice, like, don't keep doing it. Because obviously you will keep getting caught. And he's messing around with people. Because I checked out this girl's Instagram. She has like over 150,000 followers on Instagram, which means that she's kind of known as well. So the, he's messing around with someone that is that has some type of popularity and that can get mad and like do this or feel bad about the situation and do this. So he should just know how to check like, actually cheating is never okay, but he should know what to like, if you want to mess around, he should, he should know how to do that. Because you cannot be a player and don't know how to play. Like, he's a player that don't know how to play. He's not good at the game. So he should just stop. And like I said, cheating is never okay. Especially on your wife. And the thing that pisses me off the most is that I'm not going to question the religious side. But I feel like Quinn is really religious. And she actually means it whenever she talks about God and everything. But every time he mentions God, Jesus, this, that, that, and the third. I feel like it's just fake. Because if you really believe in God and believe... In Jesus and all the stuff that they keep saying on their videos you should be doing this to your wife because at the end of the day you guys are married and if you know the Bible says y'all shall not commit adultery so basically he is already you know sinning we are all sinners yes we know but you cannot sin so many times doing the same thing so many times that means you really don't care about that God you claim to pray or that Jesus you claim to call upon so yes guys, this is my my basically my point of view about this video. Don't forget to share this around. Like this video, comment down below any type of video you want me to do next or react next and I definitely will do so. Right now I'm on my way to this um creator studio um event, my first YouTube event. I'm so excited. I'll do my best to uh vlog it, but um I'm about to leave in about 15 minutes. I'm just about to dress up and be on my way out. So yes guys, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. Once again, we are almost at 2,000 subscribers, guys. I am super excited. You guys are just the best. And I will catch you guys on my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah. Oh, we should call him. Oh, oh we should call him. We should call him. Okay. I'm going to call mm -hmm. him right now. Okay. Fucking bitch. <laughs> He's such a liar. Such a liar. He's good at that.